Hey guys, what's up? My name is Elsie. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome back. If you're not today, uh, Abby and Zoe are joining me. Oren set up like a huge scavenger hunt around, I think the whole town of Charleston. And uh, we're gonna go on it. He's about to give us his first clue, but also it's been so pretty all day. It starts raining literally, what, 15 minutes before we leave, yeah. likely. It's okay. So though. we'll see how that goes. But uh, yeah, Zoe's gonna drive. I'm gonna film. Abby's coming. <laughs> <laughs> Abby's yeah. just looking cute. We'll let you know when we have our first clue. <laughs> to a vehicle. Go onto the front porch to begin the journey. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. <laughs> mm, I wonder. Go to the tallest viewpoint of the lake. If you know the way, you can save yourself miles of walking. Oh, I it's totally know bend. it. Yeah. Yeah. The closer you get no, to the clue, so the more the closer you get to the clue, the more cautious you will need to be. Went. Went? <laughs> Went? <laughs> what? Really? On our way to our first that location. <laughs> We're going on a hike. We're going on the first location. We gotta walk a long way. <laughs> it's a beautiful day though. It is really pretty over here. We got to the first location. Um, we cannot find it. We cannot find it. We're just hoping it didn't like blow away once it started raining. So it like we look down and it's water. <laughs> this has gotta be it. This is this the is the tallest point. point of the lake though. I feel like it's in a tree. That just seems like orange. I know, but <laughs> we also don't know if it's in like a Ziploc bag, like the first one. I would hope. Because it like, it like rained. Top of it? Uh -uh. No way. He can't. I don't think he could reach that. He is a jumper. Call him. It said, we be just, cautious. It said be cautious as you get closer. The last line. Caution tape. That Duh. Oh so my gosh. We need to start bringing the clues with okay. us. What? Oh, that's my Tupperware. <laughs> yes. I don't care. I, that might have been one of the random things he bought at Walmart. Do you wanna? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. It says. Clue number two. Go where splinters and bruises have faded only into a memory. <laughs> Once there, use the provided tool to help find the next clue. Splinter. Remember, X marks the spot. Pineapple? Pineapple. <laughs> Pineapple. Okay, so would that be the first time we played wood chips? Probably. That has to be played. Carl Sandberg doesn't. But the park is destroyed right now. Maybe it's the lake one then. But he didn't no. play there. Splinters? Who got a splinter? Splinters and bruises have faded only into a memory. Wooden. That's wood. That's wood. Carl Sandburg isn't wooden. But none the of the chips. Oh, yeah, true. Wood chips. We can go to Carl Sandburg. Yeah. What if it's not that? Yeah! Go <laughs> Abby! I don't know. Well, Should we go to Carl Sandburg? Wait, if there's no playground there, we gotta just gotta dig up in the wood chips. The wood chips are still there. True. And X marks the spot. And maybe that's to help us with that, it. Yeah, that is. He said the yeah, tool. Cause yeah, because X marks the spot. I oh, like yeah, use the, the provided tool room. to help find the next clue. Okay. 
guess we're going to Here we go. <laughs> so on the bottom of this clue you saw that it says like a random pineapple and the first one said a random lint so we're kind of thinking that we have to like piece together a story or a sentence or something at the very end like maybe that's our last step we're not really sure but we're we kind of think thinking that stories with the word pineapple yeah <laughs> we don't really know so we'll update you on that later i guess <laughs> Okay, we're at what we're pretty sure is the second location. Um, it's just a school in town. But it's But we're kind of thinking that... We're kind of thinking it's in this ginormous pile of wood chips. Because we play a game called wood chips here, where we kind of get bruised up sometimes. People on the softball field. Okay, wait, where did you guys think you saw an X? Right in front of us. In the wood chips. Am I just stupid? I think we might be. Yeah, I think we're just stupid. Oh, okay. <laughs> you see where that little pile goes up? Yeah. yeah. We should inspect it though. Yeah, definitely. Is this an X? Where? Like. Where no, I don't think so. Do you think maybe he like drew one? Like. Same. Okay, now we're going on a random trail because we literally could not find an X anywhere in the wood chips or the whole like rock area. A little rusty toasty. Uh -huh. <laughs> hey, Hello? Hello. Um, we can't find an X. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, wait, where, where are you exactly? We're at Carl Sandburg. Okay, where, where are your feet at? Right, like where you see Well, we went on the trail. And then so we okay. found the poles. We found but the we poles. Looked everywhere Did you put those the... poles there? Uh, um, okay, so don't, it's, it's not on the trail. Okay. But we not looked on the trail. everywhere in the playground. We did. We looked, okay, so is it like in the middle of the poles? Did you put those there? Um. <laughs> he can't tell us. What would, what would that, so say I did put them there, what would you do? Well, well we, we went the to middle. the middle, like where the lines would cross. There was like, we couldn't, it was, no, there's nothing. There's no X. Um, and then I looked on two of the poles to see if one of them had an X written on it. And they didn't. So maybe it's like on the two that I didn't look at. <laughs> um, I mean, you have the right idea about the poles. Um, mm -hmm. you, you said you went where, what do you mean? Can you further explain what you meant Like, you know, the middle of an X, the lines cross. Mm -hmm. I love how you're yeah. not telling We us. went to that point. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay. We did not find anywhere to dig. Like, we didn't, it didn't look we went, like there would. You went to that point? We think so. Okay, well, well what are you supposed to do at that point? Dig, dig. but it didn't. <laughs> I don't know, uh, we'll call you back if we find it. Um, <laughs> Oren's on his way <laughs> because we literally cannot figure this out. He said stand at the point where the lines would intersect from the X that he made with the poles. There he is. But we're literally standing there and we dug and we can't find it. So he's here. Um, it's also acting like it's about to start storming. But we're doing this thing. Rain or shine. Yeah. Tornado or not, we're doing it. <laughs> I don't know about that. Mr. Mathematician has to get the angles precisely. <laughs> oh my gosh. Whoa. How far did you put this thing? How hard do you think we can dig? Is that it? No way. No, that's not it. Oh, <laughs> that's like a brick. Oh. He can't find it either. <laughs> so he's just going to read it to us. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you got it. Yeah. I got it? Yeah. It's on your phone. You can look for it, but I'll take a picture when I find it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's read it. Clue number three. Spencer enjoys this sport. Tennis. Look for the next clue where Oren competed with him for the, the first time. SpongeBob. <laughs> high school tennis court. <laughs> he played on this court, this first one. Wait, I see something white over there. Do you see that? <sighs> mm. 
And that is just a receipt, okay. We're gonna have to call him again because we just searched the whole entire tennis courts. Well, inside, where are you at right now? We're at the tennis courts. Where are you standing right now? Uh, well, we were inside the gate. Now we're by the car. Okay, I'll, I'll give a hint if it means anything. I don't know. Um, okay, so let's see. Uh, how about instead of thinking outside of the box, think inside of the sphere. Okay. <laughs> oh, inside of that ball. Where'd it go? Did he hang up? Yeah. Update, we still cannot find it. The only spheres we see are balls. No, it's inside of it. Inside of the ball. Yes. Ah, uh, found oh it. <laughs> I can't grab it. <laughs> I can't either. Wait, wait, wait. You squeeze and then I'll grab with my fingies. <laughs> Why is he so creative? <laughs> oh? Okay. There we go. <laughs> Do you want to read it? Me? Yeah. Every night oh, and then. I see my name on this one. Oh, <laughs> my Every now and then, people get a little stressed. What do normal people do to relieve stress? What do we do? We, not including Abby. The next clue is there. Mediocre. What? We're thinking. Abby, Abby is thinking, and I agree, but I didn't come up with it, um, that maybe it's in the car, because we drive around sometimes to relieve stress, I guess. But Abby doesn't have a car, so Abby can't do that. So maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's in my car. We found the one in the tennis ball. Now we're trying to think of what we do. I have no idea what oh we do God, to relieve right? stress. But Abby can't because she doesn't have a car. Yeah, that's what we're thinking. Oh, God. Um, that's not quite it. Oh, boy. Quite? Not to. This is a one time thing. With this, me, you, and Zoe? Yes, because Abby's not included. Okay, so Zoe, it does include you. He said it's a one time <laughs> thing that me, you, and him did. <laughs> what did. Did Nick go? What did we do? I can't help you with this one. This is your guy's. Yeah. <laughs> was Stress. anybody else there or was it just the three of us? Just the three of us. What? He remembers that. After we did it. After we did it, Adelie was like, why didn't you invite me? Is it when you smash pumpkins? <gasps> yes! <laughs> I was so smart and I wasn't there. I love that you're the only one who got that and you literally <laughs> were the one not there. Stress. Okay, we are at the spot. We threw pumpkins off the bridge. Ah, Isn't I that see. pumpkin? See it? Oh, he's so smart. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, wow. it says... Better hurry. Next clue's on fire. Bonfire. It's at your house. Is bonfire <laughs> spelled like your last name? Is it really? Wait, yeah. There's two N's. The. That's funny. Are you? I wonder if he... <laughs> Did he knock on your door? Yeah, like my mom hasn't said a word about it. Oh, maybe that's why she was so excited. Like raving. <gasps> <laughs> I could totally see him like, I'm going to stab her. <laughs> yeah, no, he definitely would. That's so oh my gosh, that's so funny. <laughs> We're at Abby's house. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Oh. That's the toolbox. Um. <laughs> What? <laughs> what is this? Text or in the secret phrase. Yeah. All of the words. Text or that's what I'm thinking. Ah. We have to decode the word. Like, you want to go get all the clues? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> SpongeBob went to the mediocre no, pineapple. Yeah. What? But, but there's not no two. Went inside. Went inside. Yeah, it has to be. Okay. 
Okay, I texted it to him, so we'll see if it's right. So I'm guessing we're waiting on a code? Yes, I agree. Clue seven. You girls can use a break. Go to the coffee shop on the square and yeah. place an order for a drink or drinks. Play some checkers while you wait. It's 728. There's no way. Is it even open. still open? I don't think so. But don't tell them. <laughs> well, we need, oh, the, we need the, we the code. Isn't it? It's open. It closes at 9. Okay. Oh, let's wait, go. Do we have to take this big old bundle? Off? I guess so. <laughs> Maybe it's for later. Tabby has a friend at, who works at the coffee shop we're going to, and she just Snapchatted her and said, I'm working, tee -hee. Yeah. How does he think of these things? He's <laughs> never met her. He's, yeah, I know. He had no idea. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, we're at the coffee shop. <laughs> Did she just hand it to you? When is T Swift's birthday? Are you serious? When is Taylor Swift's birthday? It's twelve thirteen. That's the code. <laughs> oh, that's the code on the box. That's the code. Okay. So now we wait for our drinks. All right, we're putting in the code now. It's Taylor Swift's birthday. So it's 12.13. It's getting dark, we need to like... I know, it's getting dark. Okay, Abby's putting it in back here. We're just watching her. We have our drinks now. Did you get it open? Yep. Oh, heck yeah, she got it open, okay. Ah! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> These people are like, what the heck is this man doing when he went to Walmart and bought all this stuff? <laughs> Do you push him in, maybe? No, is it open? Oh, got it. What is it? Whoa. What is that? Congratu- okay. Clue nine. Congratulations, you are almost there. Here's a map of the destination. Orange drew it up the best he can. Oh. I'll need to see that one, man. <laughs> Um, our house, Old Main, Fox, it's see. Fox Ridge. There's like a dog or something. It's Fox Ridge. Can That's the lake. I yeah. can just get a go if I get That's a not here. fox. Oren just called and he said, you know that map, there's the weird little circle thing and, the, and he explained the drawing without saying what anything was. He's like, instead of going to the fox thing, let's go to the weird little circle thing. And I was like, okay, let's go to the lake. And then he's like, and I will see, I, don't know, I might see you there. <laughs> so, pretty sure he's there. So, we're driving to the lake because it's a lot closer than Fox Ridge. The sunset is so pretty. The sunset is really pretty. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see it. Also, this drink is so good. Abby and I got the iris smoothie. What is it? It's a wild berry smoothie with a scoop of raspberry chai. It's really good. So, we got. An ice latte with vanilla? I think so. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Hello. We're at the lake. Yes, I am getting close. What part of the lake should we go to? I don't know. This is the main part, I guess. So, like, by the playground? Sure. Okay. We'll go that way. This is fun. Thank you for doing this. <laughs> <laughs> Mastermind himself. Oh, Drew was so excited. She was. Are you working? She's a, yes, I am, TV. Well, that's pretty much it. So. <laughs> I didn't even know. Did you just get that out of my closet? You got it. Food! Yeah! yeah we you? were so hungry. Abby hasn't eaten anything all day. Yeah, where do you want to go? Can we hear you? Sure. Down there? Either one is fine. Do we have a blanket? Mm, yes. Okay. So, like right here? Sir? <laughs> you tell us, boss. <laughs> yeah. This is it's pretty much over now. It's pretty much over. I'm like, the way that you're talking makes me think that. Nah, it's over. Like, it's nah, not. It's not a big enough blanket. <laughs> it's okay. Woohoo! Look at us. Woo! <laughs> thank you. <laughs> 
Hey guys, so I'm just now editing this video and realized that I didn't really do an outro. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. It was seriously so much fun and I hope that you guys can tell that. Oren was so creative with it. Big thanks to Oren for doing all of that for us. One more thing that I wish I would have videoed and added, he never found um, the clue at the park that we went to like by himself. And so after we got done with the scavenger hunt and after a couple of our friends got off work, we all went with rakes and like that little trowel that he gave us with like our flashlights or it had a headlamp. We all went back to the school to try and dig this clue up. So there was just like, I think there were six of us there. Yeah, there were six of us just digging in this school playground. And it was just so funny. I was like, the cops are probably gonna think we're like, burying a body or something right now but it was so funny it was just a lot of fun so i kind of wish that i would have showed that but i didn't bring my camera oh well but once again thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope that you enjoyed i this is one of the most fun videos i've ever filmed and let me know if you have any other fun video ideas you want me to try don't forget to like this comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video which should be a makeup one if you made it to the end of this video, comment the, I know there's an emoji on iPhone and it's like a treasure chest, not a treasure chest, it's like a pirate flag. So if you made it to the end, comment that if you're watching it on an iPhone and then I'll know. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you later.